So this morning we will do the Qigong um, exercise to support our neck, our back, and our hips. Uh, we, we have a lot of tension from our back, especially we sit too long and also our neck too. So we can do a uh, few movements for that. Before that we do um, a warming up and after that we can do uh, uh, about six movements about uh, support our neck, back and our hips. And then we also do some martial movements. So let us do some warming up together first and uh, so that we can start it. Shake your hands. You jump a little bit. You jump in such a way that you feel joyful. Your two hands, uh, shoulders, and your legs relax. You release all tensions and worries. You can make the two fists together, and then you can lower down your knees. Move your body to the left and to the right. One hand touch shoulders, another hand touch your lower back. Inhale, exhale, in, out. Relax your back and your chest, shoulders. And then you open your palm. Look like you are swim, swimming backward. Inhale and exhale. And your two knees uh, square, um, bend down like uh, in the centers, who stands in the centers. Yeah. Inhale, exhale, relax your palms, and your arms, your hands. That's good. And we can. Make circle with your two hands. Relax two hands. And then we do reverse. When you move your body, you feel that you are alive, right? But it's so feel joyful to move. You can move your hands. And you can shake your hands, right? Okay, so you can... Close your eyes and relax your neck, your head. And move gently, circle. And do reverse. That's good. So you can stand by one leg and then relax your wrists, your toes and your knees. Then we'll do reverse. Then another leg. Then reverse. That's good. You put your two palms on your hips, and then you relax your 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 hips, your waist. Slowly. Do reverse. You breathe through your nose naturally. When you breathe in, it's uh, deep, it's, like it's deep. When you breathe out uh, long, that is long. And just uh, observe and follow your breathing in that way. Yeah. So move your hand to the left and cross. One hand cross your head, and another hand will stretch in the back. And then your uh, right leg over here will uh, touch by the toes. Okay, breathe in, and release it out. Inhale, exhale, in, out. 
one more time. Inhale. Exhale. In. Out. That's good. Once you breathe in. Out. You bring your mind back to the body in the present moment. Okay, open your palm one more time. Breathe in. Bring your mind, intention back to the body, very here and now. And then you put the two palms in front of your low abdomen. Yeah? Relax your two legs. Relax. You can shake a little bit. Yeah? Relax your legs. You feel your body right here. Are you here? Yes, I'm here. Check your mind. You really here? You feel your body. You don't need to think. Just feel your two feet on the Mother Earth. Two palms in front of your lower abdomen. You see that during the exercise time, you pay attention to the center of your body. Even your heart or your low dan chin, there is a low abdomen. That is one point we call the dan chin. Low dan chin is uh, under your navel area. Okay? Sometimes you have a lot of anxieties and fear, even a lot of, a lot of energy, sexual energy. Pay attention down here is better to feel kind of relief and grounded. Okay? But when you stay too much up here, look like um, the branches, the storm come maybe stronger, right? So the moment that you feel really a lot of stress and fear, a lot of anxieties, just bring your awareness back to your low abdomen and feel the rising when you breathe in and falling when you breathe out and you feel grounded with Mother Earth. Inhale. Exhale. One more time. Breathe in. Out. And let you feel relaxed. Feel your two feet on the ground. Rising and falling of your low abdomen. Yeah. And you don't need to think, you just observe your breathing. Okay, so the first movement. <laughs> Everybody smile. Good. <laughs> Holding your hands together, we call the, the um, stretching palms, okay? Breathe in, lift my hands up, stretch up. And then out, I turn to my left. Okay? And then inhale, up. And exhale, slowly stretch my palms, open. Low down my two knees, gently like that. Inhale, holding the hands again. Stretch up. Exhale, turn to the right, and you will look the other way in the back. Inhale, center. Stretch up. Exhale, open. So you can relax your back, your neck, and your shoulders. Inhale. Exhale, left. In, center. Straight up. Oh. In. Out. In. Center. Out. You relax your spine. Relax your shoulders and lower back. Inhale. Exhale. Left turn. Inhale, center. Exhale, open. One more time on the right. Inhale. Exhale. In, center. Oh. That's wonderful. Open the two palms. Breathe in. Gently, deep. Out, slow, release all tensions from your shoulders, your neck, your lower back. The second movement you call the circle arms. Stand two legs uh, parallel together naturally. Inhale, raise my hands up. And exhale, I move my hands now from the left until I touch the fingers with the ground. Two legs straight, yeah? And if you cannot uh, 
move uh, your hands touch the ground it's okay but you just do as far as you can okay and then you move up from the right side and inhale okay and do reverse exhale so you circle arms and you can feel your lower back keep your legs straight inhale up stretch a little bit and exhale do reverse and you observe that your circle will be bigger and bigger and you do slower a little bit inhale go down exhale and then inhale up reverse exhale your two legs straight inhale up you let your arms your upper part of your body circle around and help your lower back and your spine inhale reverse exhale in up out down in one more time out in that's good and then come back out open your two palm breathe in out I feel my ancestors breathe out with me I feel my descendants children in my body with my breathing in with peace breathing out with joy and then we offer a smile to them you feel the mother earth on the on the feet on your two feet connection the body mm. shake your hands jump a little bit <coughs> your practice exercise qigong is the way that you can free free your mind free your worries and stress that is my goal <laughs> always um, feel so joyful so good with this body okay so the third movement we call the bending low back so you can put the two uh, first index fingers and thumb together like this and then you can touch your lower back by in the back of your hands, okay? So in this kind of movement, it looks like you are use two hands to support your lower back, okay? And your kidneys. So when I breathe in, I will look in the back, bend my head backwards this way, right? Relax my neck. And when I breathe out, I bend forward my head, okay? Slowly bend my lower back too. I look down to the earth. Even slowly, when I look further, I can look through two, two legs, right? But you just uh, don't force yourself. Just slowly, you can bend further and lower, okay? So, breathe in. I look upward. Bend my neck. Breathe out. Bend forward. Look down to the earth. Relax my lower back. My two legs straight. Huh? Two knees straight. Inhale up. Exhale, bend forward. Feel my spine, my lower back, my neck. Inhale, up. Exhale, bend forward. Slowly, you can bend forward further. And you can bend also backwards your neck. Also lower, right? Look up. Inhale and exhale. Bend forward, look down to the earth. Inhale. Exhale. In, one more time. Out. Oh. 
That's good. Be gentle with our lower back. Breathe in, open your palms. Out. Rest. Let it go. Let go all worries, stress, fear. And be confident with your body. Breathe in. Breathe out. The fourth movement we call the separating heaven and earth. So you can open your two palms like this. Breathe in. I hold my two palms together. Right palms on the top. You may do exactly like me or you can do look at me as a mirror is fine. Huh? And exhale, turn one time forward. Inhale, another turn. And then exhale, press one up, another one press down. Your spine could be straight. So you can uh, feel your two palms separating heaven and earth. You touch the earth and you touch the sky, the heaven. And you imagine your body in the center of the cosmos. Solid, but free. You breathe in and out three times in that feeling. And relax. And after that, one hand with your brain, another hand with your lower back. Okay? Like that. And then breathe in, look to the left. Look the other way, over there. Out, return, open your elbow. Inhale, press, turn the other side. Exhale, come back, open your elbows. In, out. That's good. Right now, breathe in. Left palm on the top. Okay. Out one turn. In another turn. Out one up and down. Breathe in and out three times. Feel free, relax. And then one hand with your brain, another hand with your, with your lower back. Okay, breathe in, turn to the right, and look the other side in the back. And out, return, open your elbow. Yeah, inhale. In, out, another time, breathe in, right palm on the top, out, one turn, in, another turn, and out, one up and down. Relax your knees. Relax your two palms. Get in touch energy with the earth and the sky. Let it go all worries, tensions. Breathe in and out three times. That's good. One hand with your brain, another hand with your lower back. Breathe in, turn to the left. Out. Open your elbows on the right. In. Out. In. Out. 
Place in left palm on the top. Out turn. In another turn. Out. Separating two hands. Breathe in. One hand with your brain, another hand with your lower back. Breathe in, turn to the right. Look all the way there. Out, open the elbows. In. Out. In. Out. That's good. Open the two palms, breathe in, out, I bring my mind back to myself, to my body. Relax shoulders, your palms, your legs. Okay, shake your hands, jump a little bit. Okay, everybody doing okay? Yeah? Smiling. <laughs> when you smile, you can feel your body really alive and joyful, right? But also more confidence for yourself, for your health, okay? So the next, we call the body curving, looking up and down. Also, this movement support your kidneys, your lower back, but at the same time can increase your uh, flexibilities and um, the digestive system, yeah? So breathe in. Raise up my two hands together, up. Out, turn hands to face with your face. And then inhale, gently shut in the back. Exhale, I move forward until I touch the, the earth. Keep my two legs straight, okay? So you do in such a way that you can keep your knees straight, but also you can move forward to touch your hand on the ground. Can you do it? Try it. Yeah, touch on the ground, uh, further on the ground. Okay, breathe in, I look up my neck, and I will uh, raise up my heels, touch the toes. Okay, in as exhale, I push back and look through my two legs. Yeah, you feel your lower back, right? Inhale, look up, and exhale, look down, and press your lower back, look through your two legs. You keep your hands and your legs like that. Inhale, up, look up. Exhale, look down. Inhale. Exhale. One more time. Inhale, look up and raise your heels up. Exhale to put your heels down and look through your two legs. Okay. So right now the next part, two hands holding the toes, inhale, look down, exhale, look up, and then two elbows inside your knees. All right, so you can feel slowly the uh, flexibilities will increase. So you can see this one can have your hips and your digestive system, like that, inhale, yeah, exhale. So inhale, look down. Look through your two legs and exhale, look up and stretch your neck. In and out, slowly stretch your neck. Relax your spine, your hips. In out. One more time. In. Some of us, if you like to keep this position for a while, also it's good. It's good for your hips. But uh, uh, some 
Some of you cannot um, uh, keep your balance. So sometimes you can go backward. Actually, your head just a little bit go uh, front, in the front, so that you can support like that. Yeah, good. Okay, you can stand up. You can feel your two hips, your thighs, and your... But when you do every day, wow, it will be very good. <laughs> so open your two palms, breathe in, and out. Release all tensions on your hips, your lower back, and your shoulders. Okay. One more time, breathe in, deep, breathe out. Slow. Let it go on. Worries. Shake your hands. Jump a little bit. Okay, so the the next one we could do the the movement we call the, the dragon, okay? So this movement is uh, totally, I really like this movement because um, look like uh, you can make your whole body like a unique one line, one uh, stick energy flowing from your head to toe, toe your head. So two, two legs, like uh, the tail of the dragon, two hands up here is the head of dragon, right? The whole body, uh, flexible and, and uh, be uh, relaxed, okay? So, inhale, you stand two legs together so that you can feel your two knees uh, bend a little bit and then uh, feel flexible, okay? Inhale, exhale, left turn. Inhale, right turn. Exhale, cut left. Inhale, cut right. And exhale, chop down to the left. Your knees bend down a little bit, okay? Inhale, up and left. Exhale, cut right. In, cut left. Out, chop down to the right. All right. Inhale, point left. Exhale, point right. Inhale, point left. Exhale, point right. Inhale, point left. Exhale, right. Inhale, center. And then out. The technique to do this is uh, when you you uh, cut left, right? You look to the left. You cut right, look to the right, and your body look like you bend down, right? And you chop down, right? But also when you point left, your butt will go to the right, and you you like that, so that. Your energy will flow like that and like that. So your spine have a time to work, but also in the same way, in the more more flexible. Okay, look, point left, inhale, exhale. Right, energy to the right, inhale, left, exhale. Right, inhale, left, exhale. Allow yourself to go slow but also to move and bend and turn center and then free energy. <sighs> yeah. So breathe in, out, left, in, right, out, cut left, in, cut right, out, top down to the left. Inhale, up, and left turn, exhale, cut right, in, cut left, out, drop down to the right, inhale, point left, exhale, point right, inhale, point left, out, right, one more time, in, left, out, right, in, center, and then, ah, that's good. Breathe in, open your palms. Out, come back. Do you feel your body warmer? Right?
open the palm, the palms one more time, breathe in, out. Relax your neck, your back, your hands. You can may uh, take some time to do massage your body. So left palm inside, right palm outside. If you are, you are male and you're female, you just do opposite to balance energy. But otherwise, you can do the other way. It's fine. In order to, to balance energy, so you can um, move your body, um, your two palms, massage the lower abdomen. You press a little bit and then move like a clockwise direction. This movement uh, massage to help your uh, massage your tummy, <laughs> your lower abdomen, help your digestive system working stronger, but also relax your abdomen. And then massage your two hands, two palms together. And then side by side. The other side. Then you can massage your face. You refresh yourself. You order cells on cells on the skin. And then open your ten fingers to massage your brain, your head. You can uh, pull down alongside with your hair, okay? To massage your head and brain. Or you feel difficult, you can do the other way. Like this, click. Click your, your scope your head, look like you are acupressure, or you uh, brush your hair. I like to do brush my hair because uh, I don't have hair. <laughs> but if you tend to brush my hair, it's good. It's look, it's uh, acupressure of my brain, my head. <laughs> okay, next, use your first finger and your thumb to pull your ear, breathe in. Push my ear down, and when the breath out, to press in the center of my ears by the thumbs. Okay. Inhale. Exhale. Look like you massage and wash uh, your ears, and you can feel your ears warmer. Inhale. Exhale. That's good. Massage our back from a lower back and go down to your two legs and go to front and then go in the back. We can do through three rounds like that. That's wonderful. And then you can massage two hands, two side of your hands. Another hand. That's good. Five fingers together like a mountain, and then on the one hand on your lower abdomen, and so you can click that to the left chest, left uh, between left shoulder, shoulders and left chest. There is a connection point to support your heart. So you click for twenty times, 
and then you can change to the other side. On the right side. This one support your uh, lungs. That's wonderful. So, breathe in, open your palm. Out. Being all mindfulness and love and peace energy to yourself. And so we can uh, invite all of us, you can lie down to do some couple minutes for relaxing. So you can lie down on your yoga mat. So you can lie down in such a way that you can relax your whole body. Okay. You may close your eyes and scan your whole body from your toes up to your head. So this is a relaxing uh, movement, relaxing time. I always do at the end of the Qigong exercise so that I can relax my body and bring the healing energy to, to my body. So you can feel your breathing in, your low abdomen rising, and you breathe out, low abdomen falling. And you just follow your breathing, observe the rising, the falling of your low abdomen like that. Feel grateful to the body. Is there any tension, any pain, aches from any part of your body? And you just breathe in and send love, healing energy, compassion energy to that area and allow them to relax and let it go all the stress intentions. When you relax your whole body and you feel gratitude, each part of your body, you feel grateful to your heart, to your lungs, all the internal organs working very hard every day, right? And so you feel grateful to your legs, to your hands. Just always feel grateful and confident to your body so that you have a, have a love, peace, harmony in the body.
and you may turn to the body to the right side and continue to relax and follow your breathing Slowly, you may open your eyes. Just open halfway, and then open completely to realize that you just waking up in the morning. Twenty-four brand new hours are there for you, right? And you just smile to it. Smile to yourself and smile to the space in front of you. And the day begins, and you are ready for that. And you recognize that you become new, huh? You become new you. So you become new you today. So the healing and nourishment can always there with each moment. Yeah. So any morning when I wake up, I also contemplate like that. I want to live twenty four hours with love and peace, healing energy. I always notice the gratitude in my heart. So when you're ready, just use your right palms, right hand to push your head up, and then use your hand to push your whole body up. Massage your palms. The fire. Massage your two legs. Touch your toes. Breathe in. Look up. Breathe out. Inhale. Up. Exhale. That's good. So after this, you may um. Drink some warm water, huh? glass of warm water, and ready for breakfast. <laughs> yeah, thank you for everybody for being there. That's wonderful. So if you want to continue to practice and maintain every day, five minutes, ten minutes a day is good. Start small, with great benefits, and then continue, continue every day. Just do regularly, consistently every day. Okay, because you eat, you go, you stress, but you don't exercise. You don't smile. You don't relax. So how can you bring love to the body? So relaxing and healing. No relaxing, no healing. And when you have a lot of stress, sick, stress and sick and suffer. But when you relax, you will heal yourself and also to bring some kind of um, love, yeah, to your body. So love your body is love your ancestors and love your life. So. Let us stand up together. So we do the last movement. We call the cleansing breath. Okay, to let go totally all stress and fear, anxieties. Breathe in. Raise your hands up. Stand by the toe, and then ha. Breathe out and then ha to release everything. Okay, inhale. Ha. Louder. In. Ha. That's good. Open your palms. Out. Thank you, Jada Wally. Feel good. Relax. Thank you, dear friends. Thank you so much for being there and have a wonderful day. Okay?